right, good day and welcome back to the channel everybody. This is Arvin's High Life. We do videos of firewood, tree jobs, and a bit of outdoor exploring. I'd also like to say hi to all of our subscribers. Welcome everybody that's new. Sorry I'm out of a little bit of breath. Just came up this little bit of a hill here. Not the highest uh, hill, but it's definitely a bit of an incline. So we're here at uh, one of our burn piles here today. Uh, a few videos ago I showed you that one big deck that we were working on that the loggers left there about two, three years ago. Fortunately, that road got pretty much washed out. It's just completely muddy, so we're going to have to leave that sit for almost a, I'm going to say almost a good month here. But uh, since I can't get down it, I doubt anyone else is going to try to get down it. If they do, they're just going to get stuck. It's that sticky clay, which once you get that on your tires, it just cakes on there just like, uh, just crazy. But uh, we're at this another logging block. There's a bunch of these uh, beautiful burn piles here. We're going to be taking a few of these logs out here today. I'm not sure if we're going to be splitting them out here. We're uh, kind of rushed on a little bit of time this today. So we're going to at least get them uh, taken out, cut up 16 inch uh, blocks, load it up into the truck. And that's pretty much uh, going to be what we're going to be doing here today for work. It's a nice day. It's uh, only zero out. Uh, we got a bit of snow last night. It was uh, pretty much clear out here yesterday. And uh, we just got a little bit of snow last night. It's middle of February and uh, here in Canada. So what can you expect? It was bound to get, uh, we were bound to get more snow. It was crazy that pretty much all the snow was gone there for a good week or so. But in about another week here, it's probably going to be all gone again. But we're going to be using our uh, one sling here to uh, pretty much get some of these trees pulled out. We're going to wrap around the bottom, a bit of a pull, pulling mechanism that we use. Uh, helps getting the trees out quite a bit nicer and we can get them onto flat ground instead of having them all slanted. Some of them might, we might have to uh, cut just uh, off right at the end of the pile if they get too stuck into these piles. But I'll show you guys what we're gonna be doing here. All right, for a tree like this, uh, it's pretty dug into the ground here. So we're probably gonna just cut it right here, get our nice flush cut. And uh, just with our little strap, we do, we should have brought out our longer one, but we forgot it. We're just gonna wrap that up right there, just like that. And once we make a cut, we're able to uh, pull this. And since we're going downhill here, it'll be able to usually come out pretty nicely here. So. Let's see what we can do. Uh, two implanted into this pile here. We should be able to just kind of pull it down just nicely. And stuff like that happens every now and then, but uh, we're pretty hung up right inside the pile there. So we're gonna climb up as much as we can there, cut it off, and then we should be able to drag the rest of this straight out here. Let's get up there and cut that though.
All right, so this is what we got here. We brought a few of them down already. Some nice clean wood on these ones. We got a few of these smaller guys we're probably gonna be taking too. And then just over here, we brought down a few. Another small guy we'll be taking. But we dragged down a few more of these bigger guys here. Got that one over there, one over there. But next time we'll bring our sling that's a little bit more longer here so we're not bending down as much. But uh, you give these a uh, good nice little go and sometimes they come skidding down a little bit, especially once you hit onto one of these and they just go right down from them. But uh, we're pretty close to our roadway here. So once we get them all cut up, it should be a quick toss up into the truck and uh, we should be out of here. But uh, definitely a gloomy day, but still nice weather out here. But uh, let's get some sawing up here. So we got all these pieces all tossed down here. Our camera was charging up there, so he didn't really catch me uh, tossing them all down. But you guys can see where all the sawdust is, where they were at. We got them all tossed down here. We got a, one pile just over here on the other side of the truck. We're probably going to get this stuff split up here. We're still, uh, we still got a few hours worth of sunlight. So we're going to get these guys done and then head off to that last pile there to get a few more cut up and we should be fully loaded then and out of here. All right, so we're pretty much all loaded up here. We just got to get one more row, plus just our last little bit in the back here. We did drag out our last tree roadway, just to make it a little more easier here. So we've got it all nicely right here. We're gonna get it all cut up, split up, put into the back of the truck, and we are out. It is starting to snow pretty good though out here. But let's get cut. <laughs> All right, so we're just all loaded up here now. We got about roughly, I'm gonna say, about uh, two thirds of a cord, maybe a little bit more. It might be closer to uh, three quarters of a cord, but uh, we got it all stacked up there. It's some nice clean wood. It is starting to snow here quite quite a bit. Our road is starting to get uh, a little snowed out here. We should definitely be able to get out here. We got four wheel drive. But uh, it is about 5.30 in the evening. We got about another half hour worth of light before we actually can get out of here. So we're going to hit up the road before it gets too dark and get back to the house there. And we will talk to you guys again later on this week. We'll probably make another video for you guys on Friday there. But we will talk to you all then. Thanks for tuning into Armin's High Life. Bye, guys.